take a lot to keep me moving. It's gonna take a lot to make me stop. I'm racing to a five alarm. Should slow down, but I just can't stop. Why'd you stop me? What do you want? Well, let's just say it's pink. Oh, God. Forget it, pal. No way. I might forget it. I'm a nice guy. But them? They think the title to your car might be worth something. Tweaking, dude. <laughs> All right, buddy. So you lose this race and you decide to keep going? Care of her, fellas. <laughs> okay, the first one, the Dragon Fire Crossing wins. You lose the race. You lose your car. Ready? It's all right. It's all right. You okay? 
right. All right. I would have won. You had to cheat to beat me, force me off the road. That ain't racing, that's trying to murder someone. You lost, guy, what can I say? Now take your girl and walk. I think you'll find it safer that way. <laughs> You're nothing but road pirates. You gotta cheat to win. Let's go, George. Yeah, Escape, pal, while well, you still got your lips attached to your face. Yeah, George. Yeah, George. Yeah, George. <laughs> Bye, George. All right, let's hook up the Daytona and get the hell out of here. Crawford down? Uh-huh. It's, it's a little ways up, and then you take the Willow River cutout. Thanks. Hey, wait. Uh, are you new in town? Yeah. I, uh... <laughs> um, hey, I'll show you the way. Hop on. OK. I'm Jake Kesey. I'm Carrie Johnson. Hi. Great. Goodbye. Can't ride. Boyfriend? No way. Carrie, get in. Who's the kid? I don't know. I was just walking out of my house, turned my back, and the next second he was there. Like magic almost. Really? Yeah, really. Huh. Seemed familiar to me. What did he want? Nothing. He's new in town. You know, you can get killed riding on the back of bikes, Carrie. Excuse me? You're mine. And I'll do anything necessary to keep it that way. Somehow I'm your private property. You are. Nobody loves you as much as I do. Nobody. It's because everybody's scared of you. If you're not going to be my girl, you're not going to be anybody's. Minty, give me a light. Here you go. Hey, bro. Man, it's a hot one today, huh? Look, do you mind if I lay my towel here? I ain't welcome over there. Why not? Why ain't I welcome? Well, it's okay to lay here. Take your pick. Hey, you new in town or something? You got a name? Jake. Jake. I'm Billy Hankins. I work over at Big K's, slinging burgers. Listen, you ever need a burger in Brooks, you call me, okay? Man, she's beautiful, don't you think? Me and her are pretty good friends. Well, actually, she's... She used to be tight with my brother. 
She's got real problems with that lunatic she's with there now. What kind of problems? Well, Packard's a mistake in nature, a genetic misfire. Is what? Packard gets crazy jealous if anybody even looks at Carrie cross-eyed. You gotta wear dark glasses so he doesn't catch you at it. That includes your brother, I assume, right? My brother Jamie? The guy you were just talking about. He's dead. He was murdered up on the Willow River. But nobody ever knew who did it. I'm sorry, man. I had no idea. It's OK, bro. A lot of duck butter out at the lake today, Pac. <laughs> Quiff City, here I come. See that guy over there? The one with Billy Hankins? What about him? Looks like a dork to me. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of dorks going around these days, gang. Okay? Whole town seething with him. He's crawling out of the woodwork. Oh, shut up. OK. Joyce, that motorbike over there. You see him or Billy around Kerry? I want to know about it. Aw, oh, shit. Pack, I'd rather be working on the cars than... We do things my way, skank. And it's a lot of fun. <laughs> I know that's easy for you to forget with your brain turning to mush and all. <laughs> Actually, my brain's functioning A-OK, -okay, dude. It's just my, you know... So let's just do things my way, huh? Before I have to cut another ring hole in this flap you call your ear. He's an influence. <laughs> Remember, the kid on the bike. You got it, Pac. There. It's all programmed in, man. <laughs> Good. And, uh, Skank, do me a favor, will you? Get rid of that zombie piss you're drinking before it turns you into a mushroom. No problem. Yeah, right. <laughs> ah, damn. Mushroom. It's a nice day, huh? This water's a bit chilly for my taste. Good thing it's warm out. Sorry about the ride this morning. It's OK. <laughs> Billy Hankins a friend of yours? Yeah, sort of. Carrie! I better go now. Don't go because of me. Not because of you. It's because of him. You don't know him. Carrie! You know, if you want to come by some night. Yeah. I mean, after work, I'll be there. Well, so will I then. OK. Thing is, uh, where's work? <laughs> Big K's Burgers. Big K's Burgers? Yeah. All right. OK.
Coming? Sure. Good. This thing runs best when I have a good navigator. That is, if I can get the beast to start. Come on, you goof. <laughs> hey, it's the fumes off the grill, Carrie. It hurts my mind. Oh, uh, come on. Oh, God, it's him. Hurry up. I'm trying. I'm trying. Hurry up. Uh. Oh, man. Hello, Carrie. Looks like I got here just in time. You, in the car. I mean, now. Hey, listen, Pack, I was just on my way out, too, and... Hold uh... your horses, guy. Packard, please. Just get in the car for a minute. I just want to speak to Billy alone. Oh, Burrell. So what happened here? Looks to me like you ran out of those all beef patties kind of early today, huh? Hey, don't worry, Pack. We still got plenty of dog food. Hey, Pack, let's grind up some meat, huh? Hey, has this guy been wormed, or is he just a naturally gifted child? I swear to God, I'll, I'll rip your head off and piss down your throat. Hold your water, Augie. This is business. <laughs> Nothing personal, guy. It's a nice car you have here. Now, where were you going with my girl? Oh, come on, Pack. I was just giving her a ride home, man. Give me a break. Hey, Rughead. What's this Triumph worth? You're not getting it, Packard. You're not taking it. Who said anything about taking it? I didn't say, did you say anything? I don't, I don't like that. that. I don't like that. I tell you what. I'm going to give you the same chance I give everybody else. We're going to race for it. Look, Pack. You don't get my car. And if you're not nice, you're not gonna get your burgers with the mayo in Thousand Island the way you love them. Billy. Billy, I thought you understood me. This isn't a negotiation. Rex. You ever seen one of those before? Nah, uh, let's just add it to our collection first. We can figure out what it is second. All right, Billy, we'll continue this discussion later, and I'll enjoy it. I'll see you later, huh, faggot? <laughs> hey, Packard, I think he's going for the sandy bar. Let me take him this time. All right, it's your turn, dude. Let's go! All right! guy a new asshole. Do it to him Augie style. Man, I'll burn this Irene. Okay, the first to Rattlers Crossing wins! You lose the race, you lose your car! Agreed? You stay on your side of the road, man. Okay, let's get it on! Send them off. Say what? I said send them off! Take the Willow River cutoff!
think he made it? You gotta be kidding me. Local kid? Used to be. Call the meat wagon, then get a hold of Loomis, tell him we got a possible DOA up here. Loomis, we got a snuff kid up here in Mule Tail Cooley, Doggy Fisher. I've been waiting to catch you guys in the act. Been waiting and watching. Congratulations. You caught us talking. There's no law against that, is there, officer? Unless, of course, I got my wires crossed. And you caught us speaking without a permit. Clam it, wise guy. There's a dead kid three miles up the highway. Yeah, that's right, dead. Run out the highway and killed. Okay, pal. Time to drain the drug overdose sloshing above your eyebrows and tell me who the dude was driving that other car. With all due respect, sir, if you're putting us under arrest, I do believe we have right to counsel. What about you, maggot? Huh? You got anything to say, or your veins bloated with brain eradicator, too? Yeah. Well, who got killed? Augie Fisher. And there isn't enough left of him to stick in a cigar box. Hey, Loomis, I think you ought to see this. Oh, Murphy, what for? I think you should see this. That's ugly, God. Kid ought to be dog meat. Wait a minute. Yeah, Loomis. This kid smashed down a canyon through fire and busting glass. Must have been a thousand degrees in that car. Uh-huh, at least. Where's his eyes? Sent cats climbing up my spine when I saw him hauling this carps out of that canyon. Clean as if he'd come out of a hot tub. I'm worried, Loomis, something ain't right. Get him into town and box him up. I've still got a few rocks to turn over up here. All right, load him up. <laughs> you don't even want to know what I just saw, ass wipe. Now spill it. Who was driving that other car? Nobody ever saw it before. It wasn't a local car. It was... It was customized or something. Yeah, it was like a V-dub conversion with bodacious bags, you know, on a surf rack on top and everything. Oh, it was awesome, man. <laughs> <laughs> well, no one seems to be too broken up about Mr. Fisher laying there, splayed out to four points of the compass. But then again, maybe that's what things have come down to, huh? A deputy Halifax over there is going to take down a list of names for me. So if any of you guys are planning on taking a vacation in the next few days, you can just forget it. I'll be visiting you again with warrants, Mr. Attorney. OK, Halifax, they're all yours. Ugly Fisher. We got us all. Let's cruise. Yo, gutter boy. Whiskey. Let's jam. Yo, Ruggs. Right. That kid in the Daytona gave me a hell of a run last night. I hadn't tried to kill him. He might have beat me. When's the new injection plant going to be ready? Tonight, maybe. Maybe tomorrow. The digital radio killers, they're almost ready, too. Good. The sooner the better. Things are getting a little too equal these days. Sure, Packard. Hey. Hey. It seems to be the problem. I just can't believe that Augie's dead. 
mean, he lived just up the street from me. I just can't believe it. Augie's no loss, believe me. Now tell me something. What were you doing with Billy Hankins today? I was tired. I decided to go home. Don't lie to me. I love you too much for you to lie. I'm not lying, Packard. You and me. We're like, we're like blood brothers. I guess you could call us blood lovers. Is that how much I love you? And when you love someone as much as I love you, after a while you feel nothing. I never made love to you. I never will. You will. Hey, Rug. How are we doing on the digital radio killer? It's tits, man. It's totally functional. Yeah, what about the injection plan? Oh, it's ready. It's ready? Sure, I told you, man. It'll blow away anything this side of the Mississippi. Good. Now all we have to do is fit it in the vet. Fit this thing in a go-kart. What are you worried about? What's this thing going to be chopped? Tomorrow morning. Morning. Tonight. <laughs> you got that, gutter boy? Yeah, OK. What about those, uh... Yeah, Packard, I got those elbow parts sold in the Nogales boys for 2,900 bucks. Yeah, that old guy was pretty pissed off. out there looking to bust everyone. I mean, losing Augie ain't no big deal. And that's a hell of a car you got there. <laughs> Buddy, I'd put that kidney buster down if I was you. This place is filled with ether and acetylene, dig? <laughs>
Where'd he go? Skank, you pussy. Hey! Yeah. Who is that guy? I don't know. But whoever he was, he's weird and pissed off. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Yeah. Red? Yeah. Loomis here. Hey, Loomis. Oh, it's a real strange place you got here. Really unique in its depressing qualities, huh? What do you need? Bingo. You got a couple of cockroaches working here. I need a word with them. <laughs> My nephew's ganking his pal gutter boy. Over there. Thanks. Here for takeoff. <laughs> Morning, fellas. Yo. Okay. It's a nice place you got here. Skank is gonna help you. <laughs> Been working here long? Man, I smell a cop. You smell a cop? Well, I smell french fries, skank, but that don't make no sense, huh? Hey, bud, you got a warrant. I don't need a warrant when I have this badge. Well, we know our constipational rights, sir, and you can't just come in here and... Oh, wow! I got this problem, fellas. Augie Fisher, your buddy who got greased. I want to know who was driving the car that ran him into Kingdom Come. Nobody's seen that guy before. He hit me in the head and getting skanked. Hey. I can't remember dog squeeze when it comes to getting run off the roads there, Loomis. I can see why, Skank. I can call you Skank, can I? Yeah. Unless you like Maurice better. <laughs> <laughs> well, you listen good, Skank. I know it's going to be hard with your melon on chemical overload. But there's a killer out there, and I'm going to track the hairball down. So when you two crater heads get finished mining for nose gold and you get a relapse of memory, you let me know, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm just a phone call away. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. We ain't got no telephone skank. <coughs> but a little hydro pump. No. Here you go. Well, thanks, Teresa. No charge for the side. <laughs> I'm a lieutenant, you know. All units, this is Loomis. I'm at Big K's. I want everyone to stand by, over. I got an order up for Mr. Pucky. Let me go out of here. So where is he, Tuna Can? Dude, we couldn't find a slime ball anywhere. Yeah, we went cross town. Down the Crawford Gully, we stopped for a, a box of goobers. You guys are pissing me off. I want that faggot. Yeah, this freaks into us for about 13,000 bucks. 
We spent all last night banging on them two bodies. I got, I got scabs on my knuckles and everything like that. It's your damn job, gutter boy. What's he got with us? What he's got is an ass full of trouble. Yeah, it's about time we get into somebody's ass, huh? <laughs> we will be him like a red-headed stepchild. I'm gonna knock his ass lower than whale shit. Where does he go? I don't know. But I'm gonna find that son of a bitch. Hey, Carrie, I'll pick you up later tonight, so do yourself a favor and be here. He's on Lookout Mountain Road, let's go! We got action heading out. I'll keep radio contact. Say it's about time we give that yellow ass bastard a taste of his own medicine. Skank, why is it you continue to question my authority? Come on, man. You got a big audience with Rughead over there, man. Be first degree murder. Right. Hey! Hey, it's my turn! I'll teach that bastard a lesson for what he's done to Augie in our cars. Hey, you gotta raise your hood! We got a digital radio killer now! You try to run, we zap your electrical system! Let's go! Okay! First one to Dragon Fire Crossing wins! You lose! You lose your car! You got that? This one's for us, huh, sucker? Get him up! Oh, shit.
Loomis, we're still in pursuit of that black car heading northbound on Dragonfire Crossing. Have you got that roadblock set up? We're coming in at you at about 100 miles an hour. Well, roger that, Murphy. Uh, Halifax has three units just over the bridge. Let's run him right into it. Stand by. Watch your speed. Watch your speed. Slow it down, Murphy. Let him go. Roger, I got you. All right, we got him now. Got the back door open. Have him trapped, man. Give him a few seconds and he'll realize it too. See that? War of the Worlds. The invasion of Earth has begun right here in Arizona, folks. You got some imagination. Hey, I told you, working a big case stimulates the brain. <laughs> Need a ride? Nah. Good, I'd like to live to see my next birthday anyway. <laughs> I'll see ya. You scared me. This thing's quiet. How fun. Lucky I came when I did. Yeah, I noticed you got a knack for doing that. It was a dork. This is a dork we carry. Let's do it. You think we can? <laughs> you no match for the Cuda boy. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Bastard down to make his teeth bleed, huh? <laughs> well, what about the girl, okay? We can't just grab the shotgun, Mama Luca. 
The shotgun! I don't know nothing about no shotgun! Just grab the goddamn I gun, man! Gun. Oh, I was taking the shotgun! Grab it! Load it, man! Load it! What are you doing? Where's the bullets? Where's the bullets? I got the bullets! Well, load it, man! Come on, hurry! I'm safe! That's what you do best. A packer told us to keep an eye on this girl. This shit's got some kick. We almost killed this girl. We're dead meat now, Skank. You listen to me. Now, she's never going to think, man. You know, the bitch was with that dork, and she's as scared of Packard as anybody. You hear me? And we done what we was told. Too bad about the coolest Skank. What is it, take the car? Jesus, this shit's got some kick. <laughs> <coughs> Look, Jake, Packard knew I was here with you. I mean, people are afraid of him for a reason. People are afraid because guys like Packard prey on fear and weakness. Well, I just think he's crazy. Try and be brave against Packard, and he might kill you. Or he might let you go. Courage isn't easy to come by. That's how he keeps those goons with him all the time. They're just scared. So am I. Carrie, listen. There's going to come a time when you'll have to take a stand. When you do that, that's when you free yourself up a little sooner. I want to believe you. I really do. Good night. Hey, Carrie. There's a place on the Willow River. Probably if you want to go up there with me tomorrow. You like living dangerously, don't you? You want to go? Yes, I do. <laughs> Good night.
skink, you look like shit. Why are you walking? A little uh, problem with the cooter, Packard. Uh huh. Kid in a bike just came by here. You see him? No, we ain't seen nothing all night. The motorbike with carry on it or nothing, Pack. You're pissing me off. Get in. Holy shit, it's that kid! <laughs> Loomis, what the hell are you doing here? You got a minute? You got to be out of your mind barging in here like this. I got this problem. Downtown. I'm not going anywhere, guy. This is a warrant I got here, cockroach. Now move. On your feet, buddy, now. Oh, that sounds important. You all right? Yeah, I'm all right. See you in the squad car. nice once you get used to it. It's nice just being here with you. Want to know something? What? I couldn't sleep at all last night. I had strange dreams. What kind of dreams? I dreamed that the man in the moon was laughing at me. He tends to laugh all the time. Did you ever notice that? Then I was headed east on the back of a motorcycle. And the driver was Jamie Hankins. What's strange is that Jamie's dead. Yeah, I know. Billy told me. You know, Jamie was a lot like you. That could account for the dream, I guess. I like you. Sheriff's office. 
It's Murphy. He's at home. Tell him I'll call him back. He'll call you right back. Ain't you got any air in this joint? And your friend Minty? Well, he was maggot pie before the car exploded. Excuse me. Um, is it true that his eyeballs w was all sucked out of his sockets and everything? Yeah. He's just like Augie. Not a mark on him. We pulled the poor bastard from the fire cold in his own sauce. Almost gives me the will he's just talking about it. So before I nail you bastards to the wall, I'm going to give you a chance to cooperate. We'll do anything. Hey. <laughs> Shut up. Look, Loomis, we ain't done nothing illegal except maybe bust the speed limit. So why don't you give us all a break and let us get the hell out of here? You listen to me, you son of a bitch. There's a kid out there using his car to kill people. Not that it's such a big deal, since it seems to be your gang he's got it in for. So, if you guys try to take the law into your own hands, and that killer turns up dead, I'm going to see you all sniffing cyanide <laughs> in the Arizona gas chamber. Do you read? Here we are. I'll stop by and pick you up later. Okay. You know, today was the nicest day I've had in a long time. I thought so, too. I'll see ya. Bye. You know what I mean, gutter boy? That's the truth. What are you guys doing? We're gonna go screw around. What, you wanna come? <laughs> no. Are you going on a vacation or something? I'm taking my blueprints and I'm leaving. Yeah, what for? This gang thing was okay when we had the edge. But now that there's that wraith out there that killed Augie. A what out there, man? A wraith, man. A ghost. An evil spirit, and it ain't cool. I don't know. Except I'm quitting. And if I was you guys, I'd quit too. Well, I ain't got no beef against no wraith. Yeah, it's just a damn kid, man. Packard said so. I'm leaving. Too bad. <laughs> Let's just pick a 15, bud. Let's go cruise. Scare up some poozle someplace. You got it, Skanko. Because I'm a four day virgin.
Kind of a mess now, don't you think? The gutter boy. The skank. They were they were right there. It's like they vaporized. They were adios by the kid in the turbo. I warned them. I warned them. What are you trying to say, boy? <laughs> the skank and the gutter boy were in there when the face blew. I know it seems impossible. I didn't know they had a kid in the car. I didn't know it was Jamie Hankins until he came up missing. So what you're telling me is that Packard and the others killed Jamie Hankins? Jamie Hankins was here the other night with a shotgun. A dead kid with a shotgun. I seen Give his eyes, break. Loomis. I seen his eyes, and I got a real bad feeling. Bad feelings don't add up to resurrection, buddy. <laughs> if it was Jamie Hankins, then why'd they kill him off in the first place? I don't know. I've been too scared to say nothing. Packard hated Jamie. Packard hates everybody. He hates me. I don't want to get killed over something I had nothing to do with. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You go on home now, and you stay there till you hear from me, huh? How you doing, kid? I'm uh, Officer Loomis. Can I have a word with you? What do you need? I'm swamped. Need some information about your brother. That's easy. He's dead. Order him up! Yeah, I know. But um, his body never turned up, and now I've got four dead kids in one week. Four? I thought it was two. Stank and gutter boy got lunched out at the warehouse. Wow. I figure Packard Walsh is next. Yeah, well, if he is, I'll shake the hand of the guy who does it. Order up! That might be, um, impossible. Did your, uh, brother have a girl? Well, the night he was killed, he was with Carrie Johnson. Everybody knows that. Somebody busted in and smashed her head. She woke up the next day in a deserted highway somewhere, wrapped in a Navajo blanket. Does she have any idea who did it? Uh, drifters, maybe. Maybe smugglers. Maybe Packard Walsh? Who knows? She never knew who did it, or she would have said so. Carrie Johnson, huh? Mm. Thanks. Order up. Hey, uh, officer? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's my brother have to do with four dead guys? I mean, what's the connection? That's what I'm going to find out. Now just is not the time to confront Packard. Well, if you don't say something soon, you're going to be his prisoner for a long time. Who are you? Ask Packard. Packard? He knows why I'm here. See, I've come a long ways for you. My time is just about over.
for Gabriel. There you go. Here you go. Anything else? I can't talk now, Packard. I'm busy. Yeah, I've been checking you out the past couple of days. You've been real busy. Would you get out of here? I have to work. Nope. What are you doing? Get in the car. Oh. Hey, what the hell are you doing, man? Are you crazy? Get out of my face, burger boy. You wind up dead like your brother. going somewhere no one will ever find us where's that Packard West California Santa Barbara someplace like that I'm not going yes you are Gary remember that night when you guys found me with Jamie Hankins I don't know what you're talking about well think when you broke in and we had just finished doing it. <gasps> so it was you. Yeah. I was always with Jamie. I never made any promises to you. You're mine, that's it. You think I'd go to California with you? I'd rather go to Nogales, have the gutter boys Cretan children, and die than to be with you. You better shut up now, Carrie. I'm gonna have yeah, to... Yeah, you can kill me too, Packard. But you can never make me love you. Packard, you're pathetic. this later. Diamondback.
Dispatch, we're in high-speed pursuit of Silver Corvette, red trim, and that black turbo. Uh, Roger, Unit 64, uh, give us your location again, go ahead. Come in, Loomis. So we're we're heading north on Diamond Back, 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 back Highway, over. Uh, roger that, 16, uh, north on Diamond Back. Like all the others. Loomis, there's only one body here. Covering up. You want us to set up a new roadblock? We can still catch a bugger. We got guys waiting. Forget it, Murphy. Roadblocks won't stop something that can't be stopped. Loomis, what are you saying? I'm saying it's over. There's nobody left in Packard gang to kill. Clean this mess up and get the hell out of here. Close as I could come to who I once was. It's close enough. Just think of this as a second chance. We were meant to be together, Carrie. Look, I got one more thing to do. Don't leave me again. Don't worry, I'll be back. It's a short trip. Back light. Sorry, man. It's 
been a heavy day already. I can see that. Well, it's time for me to hit the road. My business here is finished. Before I do, I want you to have something. She's yours now. Who's mine? It's outside. Turbo interceptor. The only one in existence. It does very special things. Take care of it, will you? Who are you, bro? You said it, Billy. I gotta go. Hey, man, wait a minute. Where are you going? Where are you going? Hey, Billy! The instructions are in the glove compartment! Wait a minute! Come back! Come back, bro! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, man, far out. Hey, Jake, who are you? See me coming 